This is by far the best print-on-demand company in terms of quality of clothing I have ever seen in my entire life. It's time to review another print-on-demand company, but I want something that really stands out. I made a YouTube post about this asking what companies would you like me to review, and I got 62 comments, so I'm let's just go through them and pick a company. We have got quite a few here. Which one should we pick? Okay, this sounds like a cool one. A lot of people are asking for awkward styles. It's a bit of an interesting name. Let's see what they're all about and who they are. We're gonna go over the quality of their products, the speed of their shipping, the ease of use of their website, and whether or not they're worth your time. And most importantly, I'm looking for a company that can be a bit different. And I kind of want to find a company that has incredible, beyond incredible quality. Because I love decent quality clothing and I want to give my customers decent quality clothing. So let's try out Awkward Styles and see what they can offer. So this is their website. You can see you've got product catalog, pricing, how it works, help center and blog. They've got so much stuff going on here. What we offer over 150 products, user friendly mock-up generator, designs, low shipping prices, 24 seven email support, integration. Integrations. Uh, it connects to a whole bunch of stuff. This is what I want to see. Etsy, Shopify, WooCommerce. And that's pretty much their homepage. Now, like any print-on-demand company, there are four simple steps to getting started. One, pick an item. Two, design something and generate a mock-up. Three, connect to a store like Etsy or Shopify. And four, get a sale. Awkward Styles will handle the rest. There isn't a marketplace like you have on some print-on-demand platforms. This is similar to Printful where you would connect it with your store. As I said earlier in the video, I'm looking for a company that has particular strength in certain areas. A company that can bring something new to the table and that's what this company is able to do. They sell well-known name brands at a significantly lower price. So I'm really excited to actually see how they turned out because by selling items that have a premium brand name associated to them, I'll be able to make more money by charging higher prices and people will be happy to buy because of that brand name. So let's go and order some stuff so we can fully test it. Let me just go to pricing. They have, I wanna show you a free option, a pro option and a pro plus option. Now you can go for the free option, but I have to say I do like that they have a pro option because anyone who is selling slightly more, it allows them to save way more money. For example, if we scroll down and we can have a look at what the discount would be, right, for you know a unisex champion t-shirt and champion is a solid man. Make, right the regular price is $16.25 the pro plan is $13.25 now I know $3 doesn't sound like a lot but in the grand scheme of things getting a champion t-shirt for $13.25 you can sell that for $25 $26 maybe even $30 and no one will bat an eyelid because it's a champion branded t-shirt so the pro plan is really really cool if you're getting a lot of sales Again, always start on the free, see how it goes, and then upgrade as more sales come in. This is the dashboard. This is the first thing we see. Okay, so you've got a whole bunch of different things here. Recommendations for me, all my history, product catalog, orders, product templates, your library, stores, integrations, like with WooCommerce and Shopify and Etsy. So what we want to do is we want to just create an order. I'm going to be ordering a whole bunch of really high quality items. So first we have to go to product catalog and then we can create some design. So let's go men's clothing, t-shirts. Hopefully by the end of this video, you should see how you can create a premium quality print on demand store and charge premium prices. So all we have to do is click on this and this will take us to the mock-up generator. And this is the mock-up generator, right? So we've got layers, add text, your library, and then awkward styles library. And go to layers, you can add a specific design, right? So we can upload a design. I've already uploaded designs and let's have a look. So We'd go to our library, we'd add, let's add this unicorn, right? And it should pop up, there you go, pops up quite nicely. And I mean, it's that simple, we can center it. We've got all of these alignment tools here, which is very useful. And all we have to do now is click create a template. Here we can click create order, upload product or view template. So let's click create order and it'll take us to the order page. Bam, we can add it to the cart. We can go through all our previous product templates and we can add those if we wanted to. And then we just have to click next and create the order. Okay, I have now made a big order. The stuff is coming from the US, so I'm expecting it to take quite a bit of time. Brilliant. I'm 
I'm gonna go and get it. I am so unbelievably excited to test out this stuff. Let's open this box and have a look at the stuff inside. Now this is what their shipping looks like. It's pretty good. It came from the US all the way here and it actually came here a lot faster than what it quoted on their website. I wasn't expecting this for another week. So I'm just happy it all came. Let me show you what I've got here. First things first, before I even look at these items, I'm going to stuff them all in the wash and then we are going to do a full quality test of the design and, and the print and a full quality test of the actual material clothing. The reason I'm putting them in the wash is because I, I want to see if the print quality is good and I want to see if they can withstand the wash test. Much, much, much later. Right, it's now the next day. They've been through a vigorous wash and a vigorous drying process. So let's have a look and see how good they are and how much they cost. And then I can let you know my verdict as to whether or not I think this company is worth it. Here I have all the different products. So we've got here, we've got Champion stuff, we've got over here, we've got Cotton Heritage, we've got the classic Bella and Canvas that everyone knows, and then we have Lane 7. And then over here we've got a whole bunch of kids clothing. The Champion hoodie. Now this is the hoodie. It's honestly, this company is insane. It's actually ridiculous. I can't fault it. I reckon I could sell these items for like 50 or 60 dollars which is a serious profit margin. It's super, super soft inside, super thick. It's got a really, really good weight to it. Then on top of that, you've also got the Champion T-shirt, which is nice and thick. It's got a really, really good shape to it. What I find with a lot of companies that I'm testing out is sometimes the shape kind of tapers off a bit, but here I'm finding the shape is actually really good. And you'd expect nothing less from, well, a Champion T-shirt. And then lastly with Champion, we have a sweater. Again, it's really, really soft, really thick. And we have Cotton Heritage, which I was actually really surprised with because I actually found this to be just as good, if not better than the Champion stuff. It's really high quality. I mean, the hood's got this really cool stitching effect with the double stitching. The whole thing is slightly thicker, slightly heavier than Champion. The inside feels slightly softer as well. And just in terms of, you know, the, the, the feel of it, the thickness, all of that, it does feel superior. The Cotton Heritage sweater, which again, uh, it's, it's impossible to fault these. I really want to find something wrong. I want to be like, oh, you know, there's this, which is, but I can't find anything wrong. Right, now I want to try a different product here for this video. And this is a Lane 7 crop top. It's with my original Imagine design on it. And it's really cool. I've, I, I've never thought to sell crop tops, but crop tops are really, really popular, especially as we're coming into the summer now. So definitely consider selling crop tops. It's got this really cool frayed effect at the bottom. The inside is super, super soft. The Bella and Canvas t-shirt, which honestly is a solid choice. It's a solid base product to have on your website. If you want to have a cheaper alternative, look, if you want to go for that premium website and only have premium products, then you might not want this, you might only want that. But saying that, this is still a pretty decent premium quality item, but just at a much, much lower price. Starting with just the Bella Canvas one, you can see here, the print is absolutely flawless. Like, flawless. The colors are perfect. Everything about it is perfect. It's been through the wash and it hasn't had any issues. There's no cracking, I can pull it apart and there's nothing going on there. There's, there's, no, there's nothing happening that's wrong. Champion is the reason I ordered from this company because these are the t-shirts and the hoodies that I got really excited about because I wear Champion clothing. I absolutely love Champion. I think it's an awesome brand. So I thought if I can combine Champion and print on demand, then I am I'm golden. This is gonna be amazing. And what I'm finding with the print here is it's so soft. It's so, so soft. It kind of feels like it's just blended into the t-shirt. It's very, very different feeling to the Bella and Canvas. And the quality of the actual print, I'm genuinely getting shop vibes, like fancy shop vibes. Something like it from Zara or Top Man or River Island, where they have graphic prints on their t-shirts. I'm getting that really, really soft, if not better, 
vibe from this material. This one I found really interesting. So this is the Cotton Heritage sweater and the print on this really stood out compared to the rest. And that is because you don't actually feel there's a print there. It feels like it's been sewn in to the hoodie. I mean, that's a specific type of printing clearly, but it, it just, it's, it feels so comfortable. It doesn't feel like anything is there. There's no plasticky, no scratching. It just feels perfect. And the same goes for the actual hoodie from Cotton Heritage, right? It's, it's that same kind of feeling where it's just fully blended seamlessly into the, into the material, which is such a nice feeling. I can guarantee you, when a customer buys this and it comes to their house, they are not going to have a single problem with the quality of these, of these clothes. The design on the crop top. Now, this was the most interesting. This was my least favorite, and that's because, well, it could be because it's a black t-shirt, but you can kind of see this didn't do as well in the wash as others. So in my personal opinion, what I would suggest you to do is to put all of these products onto your shop, right? Have a premium category, a premium section of your store and sell you know, champion stuff, cotton heritage stuff. Now, lastly, it's hard for me to review kids clothing because, well, I I'm not a kid and I mean, this is cute, but it's got like cute little pockets here for kids. This design, right? This is a present for my niece and it's actually her birthday. So I thought who better to review this than my niece. So let's see what she has to say. Anna L. Yeah. Was it just your birthday? Yeah. People get on their birthdays. Ah, uh, okay. But you're forgetting they also get presents. Yeah, presents. Well, I got you a present. T-shirt. What's on it? Yeah, cool. I love blue cool. You love you. I'm gonna wear it. Anna L. In this video, yeah. I'm I'm looking at the different T-shirts and telling everyone if they're good. Yes. So, do you think this is a good quality t-shirt? Um, Why? Because it's dirty. Why is it dirty? It's messy, it's dirty. No, that's the unicorn. Yes. It's clean. Yeah. So it is good? Yes. Okay. And we need to how many to wear on top. I get my arms in. Yes, exactly. It's, it's a really good for you to get your arms in. Yeah, it's so. Yeah. What's up? Bye, I baby. And finally, the last three products. We have a cute little tote bag. Again, I just wanted to order stuff, different stuff than what I've ordered previously. And I mean, I'm gonna be honest, between you and me, I'm never gonna use this tote bag. I'm probably gonna give it away, but I just wanted to see what it was like. And it's a tote bag, you know? It, it, it's, not, it's not like the best thing I've ever seen in the entire world. It's not the worst thing. It's a, it's a tote bag. It's pretty straightforward. Something that I feel every single person should have in their store, and that is canvas prints. Again, these weren't very expensive. The quality of this canvas is really good. It actually it looks kind like of looks painted. like it's painted. Yeah, exactly. It looks like it's painted, which I really like because, I mean, this is a drawing, obviously, and it, it looks it, which just goes to show how good the printing quality is. It is it's able to give you that fake painting look. I'm really, really happy with that. That's solid. And then this one I've never seen before and I thought it'd be quite cool. This is a framed picture with plastic plexiglass or something. And I mean, it's cute. It just, it just goes on the wall. As an extra product to have on your website with your designs, why not? Especially if you have cute, funny designs or you have just generic pictures. Maybe you're a photographer or whatever. Definitely consider adding these kind of things to your store. Oh my. I love this, it's great. Okay, here it is. I am smiling like crazy right now because I actually really, really, really like the quality. Here are all the clothes. Um, we had a bit of a, a hiccup with the crop top, but I have to say I am flipping blown away by the quality of these clothing. I, my mind is just thinking, firstly, I can sell this for so much more money. Secondly, m the customers who buy this are going to be so over the moon and elated when they actually receive it because I know I am. This is by far the best print on demand company in terms of quality of clothing I have ever seen in my entire life.
And I genuinely think this is going to change the print-on-demand game. We need something new, we need something fresh, and creating a premium print-on-demand brand could be just what this industry needs. Your profit margins will actually be higher because you'll be able to charge way more than what you were previously charging and the item price is only a tiny bit more expensive. I know it's mainly based out of America, but to be honest, that's where most of the sales come from anyways. So definitely, definitely consider using them. This company has trumped all. The quality is phenomenal. So definitely consider adding them to your Etsy stores or your Shopify stores and let me know in the comments what you think. If you get a sample or if you've already used them, have you tried out their champion and their cotton heritage? Let me know in the comments down below.